Arkansas is a great defense and will put somebody on him a little bit faster. Rodney Beecham does his job of forcing the load play deep. There's Nick Miller. No room to run up to him. He's being controlled by the defense, our defense. It, that's the whole thing. Look at this. The ball is hit, completed. Look how many jerseys we got around here. There ain't any doubt he caught the ball and the ball got knocked loose. We got five guys around it. And the first big turnover and breaking the game comes to the Razorbacks. And we finally say, yes, yes, that's our ball. And uh, they finally hear us. We were trying to encourage them there. <laughs> but I don't think there's any doubt it. They just lined up and just got on us one-on-one. -on -one. Here you can see we can't make their big people move on a draw play. And uh, physically, they were ready to play. You know, it's amazing. Uh, Shebest, I don't remember catching a pass. They double teamed him. They double And I think our players realize that. As part of a team, statistics don't mean anything. Look at that play. Great <laughs> job by Raven forcing the ball. There's Nathan Jones. We come up with the ball. Gerald Jones. I'm telling you, this is a thing of beauty. Watch Raven. And he even goes over the blocker. That blocker was supposed to block him. That's what happened. I felt like their new quarterback in there. He's too far. And they're great speed. We're going to go for it because I feel like we can make it and look at the running. I think we get a very poor spot on this one, Paul. We really felt, you see here, I mean, if you look at that thing again, we really made the first down and got driven back, and, uh, but that's, that's part of it. We felt like our past, uh, the re other games, that they will throw that ball deep at any time. So we felt we, uh, we got that and we got to come back. All right, look at this. The ball hangs up there and we uh, pick it off. There's Kevin running. Great chance again. Run north, Kevin. A great play. And look here, three times in a row, and we've got the ball uh, on their end of the field. We've got to do something with it. Again, look at the pressure Raven forces right there. David Basil was scraping off. A guy throws a lame duck out there. And I'll tell you, good job, Kevin. Everybody block high. Now, Kevin looked like right here, he just didn't want to get off the field. He says, I don't care if I got a reverse field nine times. I'm going well, but we're still staying in there, trying to find something. We throw a screen pass. Get a couple of great blocks right here. Bobby Joe just accelerates, makes the first half our effectiveness from being very good. Here's a good play in, uh, against our unbalanced formation. We run to the weak side of it, and it doesn't look like much. We're making four and five yards. Good gracious, and then look what happens. The very next play, the big man comes right up the middle behind Mike Erie, Andy Upchurch, Marcus Elliott, and uh, Bono Yarborough playing right tackle. Comes through right there. Watch this play. Look at the block. Mike Erie block. There's a guy there. It's a good block to knock 36 down. Everybody's grabbing at him, grabbing. You're not going to get him in. Just lining up mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, pushing flowers. you got to be hitting somebody, <laughs> and these guys can do it. Here we throw the ball, and I think if anything we could do all day, I think Brad would rather have back of moving the ball against our defense. One of the Houston spokesmen for the D or offense said that uh, switching the tackle from the guard, moving him around, confused him. Yes, I think it did. Now, look at this play here. Golly, great block. That's what we've been waiting for all year. Finally get a chance to break one, and Bobby Joe does. Holy Toledo, is that a thing of beauty. Mm -hmm. We get it a set up on 49-yard uh, line. Got good field position once more. Hey, it don't matter what's happened to pass. What can you do right now? Right there, we didn't do much, did we? We missed the block on the linebacker. That's Wynn, who was a Southwest Conference Player of the Week last week defensively. Here we're coming back, trying to throw the ball to Jimmy Shebest. And that's the pattern that we've hit, and they just played the thing better than we could. They had decided they're going to double-team Jimmy to get something going, and, and it is. But the beautiful thing, no matter what happens, even when last week it was going opposite there at Texas with the turnovers, too, you know, we're behind, they're never in doubt, you know. And I think the great thing about our team, there's not any doubt. Things go bad, hey, sure that's bad, but what can you do about this play to make it better? You can't live that play that just happened behind it. That's a hard thing to have as a team. Great effort right there. Blocking the pass around us. We didn't uh, get a good block on him. Coming back, again, we're not giving up on throwing. And watch Brad. He's got the poise to sit in there and find Jamie Luters across the field on a good 20-yard pass. I mean, I'll tell you what, Brad's a competitor. Thing go wrong like did at Texas, hey, the next play is his. He'll come right back, and that's the credit and the type of uh, athlete he is. And everybody still believes in him. Nobody down that we're not uh, out of it, and that we're not scoring as many points. Hey, we're trying to really uh, sets us back. We're our own worst enemy again. There's TJ. We're having a hard time laying a hand on him, I'm telling you. Great job by Brad just trying to do something. And how in the world this came out is just a, a thing to behold. 
We have a screenplay called. See Marcus Elliott out here? Mm -hmm. And Brad just uh, pushes Bobby Joe on, and he sees that. I'm telling you what, now, that is just a thing of, of beauty. Bobby Joe, find the drive going. Got on the five-yard line. And look at Brad here. Look at this. He finds the seam. He keeps his feet. Touchdown. There you go, Brad. That's knowing how to get to the end zone. Tell you what, as frustrating as all it was right there, the beautiful thing is you can't look back. What are you going to do now? What are you going to learn and grow from? And that's as fine a play as Brad has made all year. 72-yard drive itself, 14 to zip. And uh, right before half, we felt we could get the ball back. And uh, we almost have it. Call the timeout or not, because we wanted to force them, if we could hold them, to punt the ball and maybe get a field goal before halftime good coverage and we didn't have to so uh, you know we felt we could just move the ball a little bit and here's probably the most disappointing thing to Bobby and all of us is that we turn the ball over to 20 had we not done this of course we have a shutout mm -hmm. because they get a score right now for half I mean no matter what's happened a great job of blocking that ball I'm telling you that's the one they hit that really if they just kicked the field goal we're ready and almost uh, block this one he just does make that one. I'm telling you that isn't just a split it's impossible he is really a dominating player. Born Big again. play here just to get the ball off. We didn't want to give a chance, and they do a smart thing here. Let the ball hit. Don't take a chance on fumbling it. And they do a smart thing here. We down it on the one-yard line, which was really important. Anything there on one yard or running up the middle. Now this is a little counter play, and we're just not getting the block. We need to have a little fold block as well as we need to have it. So it's third down and long now. Third down and trying to make something happen. Look at Brad throw this ball right on the money. Theo Young, we're, again, we're throwing away from Jimmy Shebest because they were double covering him so much. Good protection. Brad rifles that ball right in there, and Theo comes inside the two deep coverage and goes down for the ball. And makes it. We've got things going. We hurt ourselves again. We have a, a clipping penalty on the play. It puts us back, and we're coming back. Look at here. There's Brad. Look at that. That's the way the play was meant and designed. He makes 20 yards running. What we're trying to do at church. Coach, look at the offensive line really firing off. Doing a great job. Look at this. Down on the 15-yard line. We've taken it from our own 10 down to the 15-yard line. Again, uh, the same play we put in at halftime, and look at him go. <laughs> 10 yards down to the 5-yard line. This is a thing of beauty. We've driven the ball right now 80 yards, the first drive of the second half, and we have a bust right here. This one just breaks our back, and, you, you know, it just takes one play to throw you behind, and that's what happens. We just don't do a good job right there. Now we end up back in deep yardage situation. Brad trying to run. He makes four or five yards, but still we're down there. But we've had a good long drive going. Controlled the clock. Hey, you got to get points on the board, and you got what you want. And it won't come right here, Coach. It won't come right here. We missed the thing, and uh, we're all disappointed. We made a good drive. At least we'd reestablish the line of scrimmage. That's important. It still gives them a lift to know that, hey, hey, we're still back in it, no matter what's happened. But I think we've established that we're still controlling the clock and controlling the line of scrimmage. And uh, we got to do a better job. Then look at the defense again. Great mm. job. Super job. Holy Toledo. Is that a job and a half? It really is. So we started out and did it uh, offensive with an 80-something yard drive. Defensively, come right back. And there's Raven. Forcing the ball again bad. There's Nate Jones. They know how hard a hitter he is. Two-yard line. Two-yard line. We missed it. So now fourth down, we're going to go for it, and we don't make it. They run an out stunt on us here, and they just do a better job on us. Here they come with a little pressure, and Brad scrambles. Right here, he sees somebody, and he's not as open as he looks like. And... Uh, Brad has to make the tackle right here. And he gets shaken up here, Coach. He gets shaken up right there and physically and uh, throwing the ball, and it just, I felt like right there he, he was going to have a trouble running the ball on the things we needed to do. Big play in the game right there, I'm telling you. Big play in the game. Rally him and keep him going because still it's anybody's game. It's 14 to 3. Hey, a touchdown, two point, a conversion, and a, a field goal, and it's a tie ball game. And they come up, and we come up with a big interception. Kevin Anderson, golly, what a great play. That's a super job, Kevin, and that just uh, shuts the door on him, so to speak, right now, Paul. Yes, indeed, that's a big play. Big play, and uh, we option, we run the other way here, our 2TJ side right here, and we fumble the ball. 
Ken Danny, of course, with an outstanding arm. Did you feel you still might have to throw? An awful lot. David Basil got shaken up some, and so we have pressure right here. That away, Mark. Mark Lee stays after him, and right here, uh, where it's just a nip and tuck thing right here. Here's one of the big plays of the game. Kevin White gets an ex outstanding jump on the ball, blocks the field goal, and, and I thought Mark Lee was going to pick it up and run it in. That way to go, Kevin. Yeah. Watch him come in here. This guy has broken all the Houston records, outstanding kicker, but Kevin got a tremendous, tremendous jump on the ball. He believed he could block it, and uh, we get the ball back 35-yard line. Danny Nutt again Before coming to start in the game uh, show here that we did dominate the kicking game, the, uh, the block field goal, the punting of Greg, the protection we have. Ooh, ooh. There's a fun. I mean, that could have been out for the year right there now. I'm telling you what, I mean, that thing is painful. That could have knocked somebody out for a year. Mm -hmm. And we get the ball back on it right now because of the rough and the kicker penalty. Danny Nutt doing a good job executing the offense. Out of way, Marshall. Look at him coming off the line, uh, coming off the ball well right here. Look at Danny again, making the first down. We got the ball on the 15 yeah, yard. You can see we had an outside play. So anyway, we got to settle for the field goal. We have to have it now. And we make the field goal. It was good for Greg. It's good for all he of us. All that he has all the time. I tell you what, he really keeps us loose. He is a valuable part of our team. We show Greg, glad Chris is with us. Here they've taken the ball, and this is their finest drive all day. You can see all of us throwing the ball, too. They're just trying to throw the short seams against zone coverage. We don't want to let them hit that big, long, explosive one that, boy, just uh, fires you up, you know, in, in a hurry. And we got good pressure. Nathaniel White again. You see it three times in the last four or five plays. Nathaniel's been in there. Where comes Raven. And there we put a little pressure on them. We, we've been playing zone coverage. Now we're going to blitz them a little bit, throw them off timing right there. And that's what uh, we did a good job of. Go back to some zone coverage here. Ball's tipped up. And uh, Nathaniel White's in there in the middle of it. He tipped the thing up. I mean, that guy's playing uh, uh, his heart out. He's all over the place. Landry says, here he comes. But Rodney says, I'm going to get you. And he did. Good I'm job, Rodney. Criticizing officials. I, we watched Rodney quite a bit. It looked like they were holding him all day, Coach. I haven't seen all that. <laughs> that, that happens sometimes, I think. But uh, right here, oh, did he get it? Great job, Charles. He's just fourth down, 34. He got his interception. He didn't care what it was. Next time, he's going to bat the thing down. Now, there's a diehard right there. We love to see those fans. Here's Charlie Washington on a fourth down play, though. He's diving for it. He comes up with it. He's finally getting the...